So welcome everybody. We are going to try challenge mode for the first time. I have not played it before. It's going to be a very much a big learning experience as we go along. Oh, sorry, Imperimeter. I think from the standpoint of the playthrough itself, it was recommended to basically bring in, if you're going to play a Force, potentially a Newman. If you're feeling really comfortable with the game, Phonural, otherwise Phonuman, has some small TP regen and much better health than Phonural, which to me is a big concern. I'm definitely worried about being one-shot by Worm Boss in particular, and I feel like AoE clear is not going to be super relevant in Episode 1, sadly. So, simple text would have been really good for clearing out everything else, so I do acknowledge that. But since I'm learning it, I don't want to go with the lowest HP character in the game. Otherwise, the recommendations from what I saw very briefly looking online, HughCast for having just raw ATP, we're probably going to end up feeding Dango a lot of antidotes as we go along, which reminds me, I should probably turn it on my tracker to find those. Since we do need to actually level our mags as we play, just to optimize it a little bit. With the reason being that for... All of the characters here, we will not be bringing in our normal gear, but instead starting over. So for example, I will end up with as many fluids as the team can find. And they are basically going to get all the monomates, dimates, trimates that we can find. Which also reminds me, I need to turn on monomates. So, hopefully as we go through, we're going to help each other out by just gathering items. So for the most part, I don't plan on killing a whole bunch of things, since I'm going to be very TP restricted. But, I should be able to at least do a couple shots here and there. And if at any point we need somebody to wait on a switch or something like that, I'll probably be the volunteer. So we have a ranger to potentially hit with uh, things like slicers more accurately later on and shotguns later. Ucast I think has an edge on the early game stuff, since a lot of the really great weapon types that you think of for ranger don't really appear until mines. But on the plus side, it means we have somebody that could really accurately use things like lock gun as we go through challenge mode. That's my understanding of it. It's very limited, but I think what I've said is mostly correct. So we'll see how things go. Also, funny enough, we're the Viridian squad. Everybody's Viridia here. So I guess we'll try it. From what I understand, I won't start with Resta until we get to around Ruins, which is going to be a little brutal. Oh, interesting, you could choose Episode 1 or Episode 2. I guess that makes sense. Nobody has records. Target time is 40 minutes? I hope it doesn't take us 40 minutes. <laughs> We're like, I don't know about that. So anyway, the other rule of thumb is if you see a switch, don't necessarily hit it. Do I only start with Foey? Ooh, that's kind of brutal. With TP material. Man, I wish I got that in the real game. Okay. I see there's kind of like a passageway over here that says nobody goes further. Uh oh. I don't know what the team's doing. I'm going to box check as much as I can. Ooh, I was going to say, I need the team to help there. There we go. Hopefully I get ice or something to deal with the boss. I'm going to drop a barrier for somebody. So you're going to be going into melee a lot more than me. Just remember, if you pick up extra items, like I just found a monomate, I'm going to drop it on the floor. So I think we have a split path coming up. So I'm gonna I'm gonna start opening boxes. The team could do whatever. I'm gonna go back to the other switch maybe. Oh, the Foey is so slow at low levels. I forgot how bad it was. Again, if I see monomates, I'll just kind of drop them as I see them. 
but I'm not going to interrupt. People, if, if they need it, people will pick it up. Like, I don't need a try grinder. I would like Barda, though. I just want to see something. Yeah, this thing is, like, telling us the way. So I think, essentially, at some point this will open up. I'm going to wear a barrier. I like how far away the luck materials opened up. So I think the team will need to step on some switches. So there's a switch in that room on the right side. So I think somebody needs to stay on it for a bit. Because I think we have to end up back here. There it goes, it's moving. So I'm going to need at least... Oh, I have to actually kill something here. That sucks. Uh, I didn't think there would be enemies I actually have to fight here. I'm in trouble if somebody doesn't help. I cannot deal with this room. I could bonk a couple of these, but... Oh, that's not what I want to do. Uh, I, I, I do need assistance, guys. I can't clear this room. Someone needs to come here. I don't care who it is. There we go. I'll go to the next room. Once the other thing is open, I see that it says ignore switch. I'm going to cast a couple fireballs since I need to remember that leveling does matter. So I'm going to hit this. I think the team could potentially go back once I do this. It's on. Thank you. Yeah, I'm going to hit the switch and run. I'm going to pop these boxes and move. Take another monomate. I get another monomate. That's fine. Two mana fluids, that's good. Oh. I think I hit what I needed to hit. So let's leave. I don't know what I opened. I don't think the left path is correct. Oh, I think because all of us are here. And, oh, we don't have anybody back in the main room. Hmm. That actually kind of sucks. So yeah, I think we lost time there. So I think what would have happened is that... By deactivating that laser gate, I think in the previous room there was a switch we couldn't stand on. That would have opened a shortcut up for other people. It's unfortunate. Healing circles over here, though. Alright, so we're learning. I want all my spells here for now. So yeah, I could see we could definitely trim time. This is where having a fourth player would definitely have helped, because we could have had two people. You got Barda. I got level one Barda. I should be good. Where if we had another person, we could have had somebody stepping on this switch. Yeah, see now the, 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 the gate is open. I will take this mine material, though. Sure, I'll equip the other cane. Try to assist a little bit here. Feels like I'm underwater almost. Oh. 
I keep forgetting if we share items. We might share items in challenge mode. Versus, like, the old PSO way, so we don't do items. Let me actually drop these, because I don't need these. Okay, we do share items. I would like a gun at some point, just so I can open things easier. Make it a witch. Let's scroll the map down. Interesting. So I noticed some of the maps are larger than others, which is a bit unfortunate, so I might have to reposition that slightly. I'm not sure where the team is. That does mean I need to shrink this down. Sorry about that. Let's continue. You, don't, don't wait for me. Just go. Just go. <laughs> it's like, I'm messing with the map. Yeah, I definitely need to bard at this guy. Alright, team at least has a gun. They have to stuff from a distance now. Right, so you need to save some TP for later. Night power is huge. That'll potentially go on the rock house. A dagger by accident, and then look at daggers. Oh, I got a one slot for him, actually. In case somebody needs it for the, the other slot. I keep forgetting we don't start with it. No, Dango. You gotta respect the hill dealt. No, that means you cannot get hit at all, I think, for the rest of the run. Because you start with escape doll. And that's it. You get one. Nothing to do here. I'll try to assist a little bit. I can't just go fully no assistance. Man, it feels like you're underwater at original PSO. Holy. Dagger there is kind of nice. Nice level up. I know I'm pretty close to leveling, so I think I did okay with TP on this level up. Or I can actually use this to speed up the kills significantly. How did that miss? Like one target from killing. Huh? There we go. There's my level up that I needed. I'm just trying to make sure the combo kill can happen. I'm not gonna like spam spam spells, but I need to do some damage. There we go. Yeah, the dagger seems to be working pretty well. So I guess we need to potentially go down here. Split, it looks like. Actually, I think Bardo was... Hold on, I'm remembering my old PSO strats. Bardo is actually really good for AoE here. Oh, I did not want to get hit there. That sucks. Oh gosh, why is no one with me? Why is no one with me? Where is everybody? Holy. I don't know where the team's going. We gotta go to the bottom right. Uh, okay. Bardo at least multi-hits here. Uh... Jeez, I'm gonna lose so many mana mates because of this. I think somebody might need to stand on this switch to progress. Which is fine. Oh, the board is so slow, I can't hit him. 
Yeah, where where is Chris? Oh, there he is. I was gonna say, we we need the team together. You guys can't you guys can't go on a magical journey. There we go. I'm just so slow, I can't do anything there. You know, I'll stand on the switch. I'm the least useful. You need to go. So they're gonna go to the right. Then they're gonna teleport in. Maybe I should have joined. Probably. It's always easier with multiple people. So I think they'll they'll have to teleport and open the switch for me. I think. But we'll see. Yeah, because I can't get through there. So eventually they'll get through. Yeah, no key. I was gonna say we can always redo it. I mean, we're just learning the the challenge mode. We're probably gonna redo multiple stages as we learn it. I'm not expecting to get it in one try a good time. I don't want to like grind the times down necessarily, but we'll see where it goes. So they'll they'll clear out what they need to clear out. I got a lot of foes. I think so, but you could always just host. And after that, it doesn't matter. Because you're, you're allowed to go backwards. And you're always allowed to retry. So we couldn't do stage 2 together, but we could do stage 1, for example. Briefly saw the door open. No key, though. Let's see where they are. Wait. Guys, why are you over there? Guys, look at the map. You, you went the wrong way. Okay, we definitely need to redo this. Do not go on the left side of the map. <laughs> you, you guys are killing me. You went, you went nowhere near where you need to go. Yeah, we're redoing this. So we need we needed to go into the arena. I wonder if that means I can take the other warp there. I'm just curious what this means. Since I have to wait anyway, I might as well go take a look. Yeah, we don't want a full clear forest for sure. What class should I play? Probably Hue Cast or Rock Cast. The more casts, the better, honestly. You can even do Huka Seal for accuracy. Oh, that was for this switch. Okay, I was curious where that was. Alright, te team is very lost. I, I need to give more directions, apparently. So, on the map that I have up on stream, you guys needed to take the warp. I, I, don't, I haven't seen where you have to go, but I can see that if you take Teleport 1, you end up in a room where you could go to Teleport 4. But I need one of you go to go to teleport two to grab me. So that'll be the upper right. So if you take this, so I'm gonna stand on the switch because you guys have to let me in. Go. You're gonna end up in a warp. In that small room where the hill delts are, you have to take the upper right warp and you have to hit the thing there so I can get in or else I can't do anything. They're not, they're not taking the correct warps. You guys are killing me. There we go. Thank God went to the right one. Now I'm able to get in. <laughs> now I can join in. There's exactly, there's only two warps. There we go. Yeah, we're redoing this for sure. But anyway, uh, I have enough mono fluid. I could just spam stuff at this point. Try to make up for some time. So I think what I, so the big, my big takeaway is to remember that Barda is like a very slow AoE, but if I do line them up, that saves a lot of time. So these are things like, I don't play old PSO, we'll call it at level one. Managed to get arrested, too bad it's not an AoE. Uh, go this way. I did pick up another HP material grinder, so I'm just going to drop them. So that way you guys can grind. So whatever you have is whatever you're using on the dragon boss at this point. Got one slot here. I'm at the boss. Need the team to come to me. 
Oof, Chris is so far away. Okay, Chris, when you turn into the bottom right room, just go north. We unlocked the shortcut already. There we go. Yeah, we, we definitely need to redo. You have a, do, is it legitimately 45 hit? I mean, I don't think I would bother with Elemental Special on Dragon ever. It's based off your level. Our level is terrible. So we're actually going to have to dodge the dragon, which is going to be awkward. I have one skipped all to survive it. But otherwise, you're going to have to open up your map. And, and pray you do not get bulldozed. So I guess what was my takeaway on the first map in particular? My takeaway was that if at least two melee go to the bottom route, the rest of it is not too bad. I don't know what that sound effect is. Yeah, sadly, I don't have any debuffs. They never dropped. You can steal's not bad. Again, if we once we get out of forest, her ability to use like a stronger gun is actually pretty good. Oh, does Barda not hit in the sky at this level? Oh no, it does. It does. Chipping them out slightly. I area map time. Respect the area map. Okay. Dodge, 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 dodge. <laughs> oh, okay. The opposite end, so I gotta go up to dodge. Ooh, okay. Chat's able to tank it, that's good. I still, I think I still die in one hit. I'm gonna go this way. There we go. That should be it. Now the boss is gonna attack. I'm gonna try to hit a couple Bardas here. Part of you. Oh, don't step on me, dragon. Alright, boss fight went okay. But yeah, we need to redo that. For sure. It doesn't have to be perfect, but we need a little tighter than that. Alright, so here, here is my takeaway. I needed to be more aggressive at level 1 with TP usage, and I have a bazillion mono fluids. So... Okay, we cleared it. Let's try it again. The love and parameter join in. Because the worst that happens is we just... redo the stage with a better time. <laughs> That's all I view it as. So we'll do challenge mode. I don't know why you can select difficulty there, but sure. So I should be able to select backwards, and if I can't, then we'll have in parameter host. So we'll also learn in real time how that works. So yeah, I think what'll happen is I need to be more aggressive with Barda. Barda is definitely like the spell. If chat finds it, I will go out of my way to go pick it up. Um, other than that, I think we should be good. Yeah, so I could do stage one. Yeah, we could trim at least like five minutes from it. So we, we mostly remember the layout of this stage, so I'm going to leave it on stage twos for later. So we know that we just need to basically go forward. Somebody will need to be in the upper left. But in the meantime, we can still at least help clear a little bit in the other rooms and go back. Because we know there's the one switch in not the upcoming room, but the room after that, which is helpful. Seen a lot of die grinders. I don't want to pick them up. I'll let the team pick them up. Is that a. I want to make sure I'm just slightly more aggressive with my spells. That does make a difference. My material is huge. Level up.
Oh, he slow to hit it with Bowie. So sad. Yeah, we'll at least melee a little bit. Start right, walking back up here. Just need one more kill to level. So again, I'm trying to be a little more aggressive with my spells. There we go. So what I'll do is I'll start opening boxes. Actually, I'll start playing in Bowie because it is free damage. That way we're really speeding things along. There we go. I'm gonna try not, in fact, I'm gonna drop most of my monomates for the team. I really don't need them. So I'll help a little bit with the clear of this room, and then I'm gonna remain in this room. Ooh, handgun's potentially a really good pickup for Hugh Casile, because she should be able to use it immediately. So I'm gonna remain, I think, in this room, and eventually we'll need to have people go back to go through the other path. Just awkwardly cut. So just remember when we, when the group takes the uh, warp into the other room, that you do have to clear the first room you're in. But when you go to the bottom right of that, you have to spend some time just to hit the switch and leave. You could take the boxes if you want on the way out, which is fine. Okay. So I'm gonna remain here. Team wants to stand on that, that's fine. We'll have everybody go to the upper left. Everybody else go to the upper left. I'll stay behind and if I need to clear it, I can clear. Because I think I have enough foe that if I do have to kill something, we should be fine. Just monitor their progress. Yeah, they're going to clear that initial room, and then basically I have to run through and hit this switch, I think. I'll adjust the map just to take a look. Yeah, because they're, they're doing the bottom right, so I just need to hit the switches, and then that should bring them in. Map down a little bit more. Because at some point, they're going to go to the bottom right. Let's take a look at the area map. Somebody's going to the bottom right right now. Nice, they're going to hit the switch. I'm going to be able to get through. And then I just have to see which one opens the main gate. Someone has to hit the switch. There we go. We're going to run, we're going to run. There's a switch here. Hopefully this is for the chat near the door. Pop some boxes. There's some healing items here. Looks like the team is moving, so team will go north. I'm gonna hit the last laser gate, and then I guess we're good to go. I don't even think I have to clear anything in this room. I'll pick up the items. My power is a good pickup for the team, I think. Oh, I got stuck. That is really unfortunate. Oh, am I like stuck stuck? Oh no. Uh, unfortunate? What am I getting stuck on? Game, please. <laughs> Just like actual gaps between me and targets. Oh. Team wasn't able to get through the door? Why was the team not able to get through the door? I hit all the switches. Now I'm confused. Yeah, the... the Yeah, the, all the all the doors should be open. I'm not sure where the team is going. I'm confused. I feel like team took a big detour. I'm just gonna look, because I hit that switch like an eon ago. Yeah, that door looks open to me now. Yeah. I'm not sure why team didn't go this way. That's fine. That, that, that's for the team to decide. I hit that switch like almost 40 seconds ago at this point. Yeah, just make sure, team. As I said before, I, I hit all the switches, so 
I don't know what to say on that part, but we'll move on, I guess. Let's go to the next area. We'll take the mine material, though. So there are some other materials we could drop here. Uh, I'll drop a look higher up, I think. So yeah, just for future reference, I had to hit the switch, I think, in the middle of the room. I picked it up again. That actually really messed me up. Unfortunate. Let's go this way. I'm going to pop some boxes, because I'm the character that deals with in the battles. Sadly, still no Barda. Hopefully we do see a Barda drop at some point. There we go. I'm on a map for sure. Right. Probably one fifty. So we don't need to go to the upper room. Let's go further down. We're going to do the same strategy as before. Let's remember to take the correct door. Oops. Damn, still no Barda. I saw somebody drop it somewhere, but I don't know where. I guess I don't get hit by dragon. I'm still good. I need to be very aggressive with Bowie here because I don't plan on going in the next room. Bowie level one. No, where, where's where's Barda or Zon? No one's there. Poe is a weird thing to get used to. I was expecting more it to be a range issue than to actually just be a speed issue, but that's what you get for not playing for a while. There's a multi-slot frame in the back of the room, which is a good thing. Team's gonna clean up the room. Yeah, the auto-target is so bad compared to ultimate, holy. There's no reason for me to not just spam Foley, because I should level in this room. That saves the team potentially a lot of time by me doing so. Oh, so it looks like there's random spawns in challenge mode, because I don't remember fighting this many waves. So maybe there's like, quote unquote, a good pattern and a bad pattern. Hmm. That's kind of an unfortunate layer to challenge mode. There is no way we fought this many previously. I'm gonna try to put a Foey out there. I mean, look at this, we're still fighting. Who's this? Right, if we clear under 20 minutes, I'll be happy. Anyway, I'm gonna keep spamming my shots because there's no way to hold my TP at this point. So everybody should go through there. I need, just make sure you all don't take the wrong warp. So do not take the bottom warp. You should be able to take the upper right warp when you take the warp and that should put you in the correct place. There we go. There we go, blue team is there, so I'm gonna go pick up the Moname, thank you. <laughs> How do you guys keep taking the roll? I'm so confused. I'm so confused. <laughs> At least somebody got the warp, we're good. It's gonna spam Foey for now. I feel like I'm being trolled. Okay, let's throw out more Foey. Sadly, Marta still. I'm not really going to do that much in the boss fight until I see one. I saw one drop somewhere, but I don't know who had it. It's been unfortunate. This is not worth going back for. Um, I'll do as much as I can here with Bowie. My damage is going to be super terrible. The 
still have a couple mono fluids. Yeah, sorry team, I'm I'm not doing anything in this boss fight because I didn't get Barda. It fell somewhere on the floor, but I don't know who saw it or where it dropped. I did get some night powers, by the way. I'm gonna drop these for the team. You can pick them up. Otherwise, we'll just move on. So, I'll do what I can, but at least we have 3 ATP, so we should clear much faster than the previous one, even with those extra waves. As I saw, it actually made us a level 4, which should make up for some damage here. Oh, that act I'm sorry. My bad. I didn't think that would kill me. <laughs> Apparently, I could die to crush damage. My bad. Now I've learned. Okay, so we'll clear this real quick then. At least we now have a good rhythm for the stage. Let's go get these boxes. One, two, three. There's a night power on the floor. I'll leave it there. If I could take it with me, I guess there's no harm. Yeah, I'll take it with me until the team needs it. I love the, the switch just freaking out. Not stand on that. Okay, so let's do that. That feeling when you swing but miss. Okay, so we'll drop one of my mono mates. Team has extra healing. level, which it did. Oh, where's Barda? Oh, there it is. Okay. That is a huge cup for me. Let's go assign it here. Good enough. That means I can assist with some AoE damage. Which will save a lot of time. But getting that early is kind of nice. I'm going to take that defense material so I don't explode later. Okay, so we're going to do the same strategy as before. We're going to cl full clear this room. And then we'll have the rest of the group go there. So we'll make sure to activate the switches there. Yeah, I'm already... Okay, I feel like I'm contributing way more with Barda. Thank you, Barda. Thank you, whoever picked that up. Open some boxes, save some TP. Because the thing is, is like, if I wait on the switch... It's actually super good because I can recover almost all my TP while I'm waiting for the team. Do you know what I mean? So I'm like, I might as well try to take as much advantage as I can. Because I still have four mono fluids. I don't even think I need one the other fight. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and step on this switch. As long as team gets the other switch there, then the rest of the other people can move. Perfect. There we go. I'm just going to regen TP while waiting. Even though it's very slow, I will take it, because it will result in at least one more spell for free. So that's why I was thinking if I had to wait for switches like this, I get a big advantage. See me slowly regathering TP. Yeah, I'm going to be very, very aggressive with Barda to make up for earlier. Looks like I already got two free casts. Ooh, a rest of drop. Nice. So just remember, chat, I'm going to hit the yellow switch, and you should be able to go through there once I do that. So I'll let you know when I've hit the switch. Okay, almost a 60 TP, nice. Okay, we gained at least two spells worth for free. So showing off the power. So Phone New World would have a huge advantage here for sure, but we'll take this. 6 TP, not bad. Just remember, chat, if you pick up any antidotes, just use them for uh, self-heal. So I think this should be the switch for your door. Double check, just going straight north. 
should be able to get through. I'm going to hit the other switch and maybe open a couple boxes while the team is still coming up. Another monomate. Lots of monomates. I'll get those. It looks like team's able to take that entrance, so now I can just leave. Perfect. Team's lining up with me. Perfect. I'm not gonna go in the I'm not gonna go in there. I got bullied last time. Let's go to the next area. Zon TP materials restless, thank you. Triple monofluid? Wow, okay, I'm gonna play really aggressive here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave some mono mates near the door for people that used it. And I'm just gonna go ahead and just consume whatever I have. That is a lot of monofluid. Oop, back up slightly. There we go. Always oh, spam is real. So now I get to contribute a whole lot more. Yeah, look at that damage. Save the team some time. Bonk. <laughs> I'm just gonna last tap it from full screen, don't mind me. So yeah, I basically just want to be spamming constantly since the team has given me so many mono fluids at this point. Uh, did I learn the rest? Sign that if we did, okay. So sadly, I can't AoE heal. That won't happen, I think, until we get to ruins. But it'll be super useful when we get there. As I said before, I'm gonna play as aggressively as possible with spells. Hopefully, we can get something nice out of it. Okay. So let's see. Already this time is looking so much better. So much better. Multi hits are nice there. Let's level up. Oh, team lined them up for me. I got a multi barda. Ooh, time save. There, but that's okay. I got Resta. At this point, I could probably just legitimately give up my mono mates for people that need it. Try to be as useful as possible here. No. some automates on the floor. I'm gonna do what I can. Ooh, a 45 hit handgun. What the heck? What the heck is this? Yeah, I was gonna say, whoever picked that up. Can you imagine if that happened in normal PSO? Like, you're just playing normal mode for the first time. Like, oh, just, just get 45 hit. Don't mind me. I'm gonna do all heavy attacks now. So if nothing else, we're just getting extra XP, which makes it a bit unfortunate for like a time attack purpose, but I, I think this run should be good enough. We got some crazy weapons. I'll stand on the switch. I'll let the team go. Recover some TP while I wait. And just remember, Chad, it's the what, the the same the same one that's worked every other time. There we go. Upper right we go. Let's go to the next area. I'm gonna eat a lot of fluid. I'm gonna be a little careful here. Oh, Dango took the wrong one. Rip Dango. Double power material, by the way, near the boxes. I'll, I'll move them closer in case team doesn't get them. 
Yeah, let me let me move him closer. I'll move him let's say over here. Back him up real quick. Man, right re regular PSO would be so fun if we got this many crazy items. Careful, respect the Hildale. Kind of like the instantness of Zond, even if it's not the most effective thing on him. Alright, so I think there is... ...of interest here. As a reminder, chat, if you picked up any antidotes, just use them to feed your bag. Do whatever you can to feed your bag as you walk. Lots of defense materials. I'll leave that all for the team. I don't need any of that. Sadly, I didn't pick up too much this run, other than a night power in case somebody needs it. Okay, so just don't get super close to the dragon, and I should be good. My health total is hilariously terrible, but I think everybody else should be able to survive a hit from the dragon. I just, I just don't think I can. There we go. Get knocked down from the team. Look, our damage is pretty good. So yeah, we're gonna get way under the 19 minutes we got earlier. A good place to save some time. I'm gonna wait a little bit, save some TP. Well, not to get too close. Alright, it's definitely time to go into the area map. I'm gonna go down to avoid. The trick is to just Oop. damage there. Hopefully, he's got some automates. As long as I'm not, like, at literally the edge of the arena, I should be able to re-navigate and dodge every time. That's good. Let's... A little two mono fluids left. That's not bad. What a, what a massive improvement in time. Oh, don't land on me. Oh, man. That was likely, though. <laughs> Get Barda. There we go. Much better. That was like six minutes faster. We don't have to worry about that for later. So we could be sloppier on the other ones. <laughs> We're good. Much cleaner. There we go. Look at that. I, I Plus 13 MSC. Oh, for where I died earlier. Oh, it's the grave marker. That's true. I think this does give you items. I don't think I can interact with it. Oh well. Rip Ziggy. I, I think those can randomly give you items by interacting with them. Yeah, we definitely gotta hand this in. Yeah, seven minutes faster. So should we be feeding Max 24-7? Absolutely. It's, if you find, I highly recommend you pick up any antidotes and, and uh, anti-paralysis you pick up because it's free stats. So anytime you find yourself moving, just eat them. It's more important for the Hue cast to make sure that they always get uh, antidote or anti-paralysis so that they can qualify for better guns. If you find yourself with like 10 monomates, I guess it's okay to feed a couple monomates for power. Generally speaking, most of the resources will go to one person. I will never feed a mag because I need my mono fluids. But everybody else can feed. We won't end up getting a mag blast for the most part, so we don't have to really worry about it. Let's take a look at the next map. Let's take it out of this one. Oh, 
this what well, is huge what the heck is this there's no bosses apparently well it's gonna be interesting so okay so let's talk a bit about the routing so i'm gonna make a detour to the south so we start on the far left sorry that the map is cut off the maps are slightly wide so i'm gonna start on the far left i'm gonna go down everybody else goes through Then you're gonna make you're gonna basically wanna go right as far as you can. So you wanna come over to the, the second one. Because I, I left my mouse on so you can see it. So we're you're gonna go all the way over to here. I'm not sure when I get to do anything in this area based off this map. But presumably you'll hit something that'll let me get through. Then you need to place a weapon on the red switch. Okay, so we, we do need to actually weigh down switches. Interesting. Hmm. Alright, well, we'll give it a shot. An hour and 20 minutes? I really hope we don't take that long. So I'll go to the south more or less immediately. Oops. Oh no, shot my fireball and whiffed. Bonk. Hello, Lily. We meet again. <laughs> so is fireball. So I think the team just continues to the east. I think I just have to break this. What else do we have to do? Oh, there's a lot of enemies in here. What the heck? Uh, apparently I need help first. That was not made clear to me in the uh, the hints. Interesting. Yeah, if we have one person come back, that should be fun. Yeah, just I literally can't even kill the nano dragon. I was <laughs> like, uh, kill the lilies though. Those I could kill. Once that dragon's gone, I think you can all run back to the east. Yeah, I, I legit don't do any damage. Oh, Chris is doing single digits. That's not good. Just, I just have no other spells to assist. Then go and move on to the next area, at least. I'm gonna open this. Well, this is just rude. Run. Whoever hasn't gotten through, just go for it. Oh, maybe I have to run as well. But I just opened the way for the team. Bye. Right, I'll try it. I don't think we've ever had a concept like that in other PSO quests. Definitely none of the ones we normally run. Maybe it's possible for me to get through. Oh boy, there's enemies here. Um, I'll strict time. If I don't get lasered. So evil. If that makes me miss the switch, I'm gonna be so sad. Oh, I almost missed the switch because of that. That was evil. Mana Dragon, please. Okay, so I can free myself up. I was trying to figure out how I would get through here. But anyway, team's just doing all this at the moment. Team is doing very well. So there's some kind of. S oh, there's a big switch here. Hilariously big. So there are apparently guns guaranteed if we open up the far door. Pick up the TV material that somebody left behind. Thank you. My XP is going to be super terrible, I think, for a while. 
Okay, so at least I'm catching up now. I'm slowly understanding. Regular handgun is on the floor. Probably want the T. I'll take the priest mine. There's a general arm which would potentially be good for the Hugh cast. Okay, so we're gonna go south, and we're just gonna go all the way south. So I essentially need to pick up a frame at some point. No, Dango! Or Dango. I bumped him. I really just need another spell. Yeah, I think we'll let the hunters kill the dragon. Is it if if it's an oh there's a rifle for Chris? I'm gonna I'm gonna give Chris a rifle. This is gonna help him big time. Big damage increase for Chris. Yeah, that should be huge. Yeah, there we go. So I'm I'm going to try to pick up items as much as I can and observe them. Just because the base ATP of the weapon actually matters in challenge mode. So yeah, the sabers are definitely the way for now. Go through here, we'll go to the south. Healing items. I guess I'll pick these up for the team. Team team can move on. Don't don't wait, yeah. Just keep going, keep going. Keep going. I'll pick everything else up. My powers, antidotes, so I could probably help the team out with some. Then I can pick up the gun on the way back. The handgun plus Five is interesting. So, yes, we need to go this way. According to the map, I have to turn here. The handgun plus five might be useful for Dango. I'm gonna try to find Dango and drop it to him so we can take it later. Keep forgetting, it really does not snap early. In case you need the handgun, we'll leave it there. I picked up a lot of curative items for people that want to feed mags, so I'm just gonna leave them on the floor for the team. Yeah, sadly here, I really don't do anything until I get another technique. Most I could do is just maybe help with stun locks, that's about it. Saber dropped. I don't even stun him, that's so embarrassing. Just gonna wait this out. This is, a, this is a hunter challenge for me. Eat this. Drop a night power. Eat a couple mono fluids. Drop two different mono mates for people that want them. Actually, I'll just pick them up then. Is that, I only need to really hold maybe three at any given time. Oh, I could definitely trim there. So we're gonna go to the next floor. Observe the map. Not too bad. Looks like we just go upwards. Apparently we can just ignore enemies once we're past this room. So I could so I right now only have Foey. I'm gonna try to hit the things that are weak to Foey. So me doing massive damage to Grass Assassin potentially saves a lot of time. Also, I just realized I don't have anti, so I might need some of those antidotes. We'll see. No, oh, rip. I forgot that they poisoned in this instead of freeze. Unfortunate. So if somebody has an antidote from earlier, I definitely want to pick it up. Or I'm just going to bleed out. Very slowly. There it is. 
accurate. Thank you, team. Can I not level? Yeah, I did damage in case it needs me to tag. I don't remember if tagging XP is in this, because I'm assuming that's why we're desync, and we genuinely need to tag the level. There we go, I needed that level up so bad. Uh, so we're gonna ignore this, and it looks like there's some kind of horrible monstrosity in this upcoming room. So we can ignore these. Go through the fake passageway up here. Evil. Oop, team. Go to the north. Ah. Uh. There's some kind of weird puzzle. Okay. I'm assuming I need the whole team here. I'm gonna stand on the switch. I'll let team also stand on the switch. I right, so go to the right. And presumably we should be able to all I'll open the boxes, don't worry about it. Team just has to hit the switch. Team just has to hit the switch. There we go. There we go. He's gonna let me through. Thank, thank you. No, 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 no. Come back, come back, come back. <laughs> no! No, Chris! Chris, come back! <laughs> Somebody has to open the switch for us. You can't just... It, it's, it's not a full time. Oh, that's unfortunate. So we, we did get locked out of the boxes. Everybody moved. That sucks. Well, we'll, we'll just move on. Fun. Yeah, it was like every, everybody touched the switch and then just immediately left. It was like, wait, I can't open the things if everybody moves. And then I got left behind with Dango. Dango and I were just left to, to die. <laughs> like, this is our home now on the other side of the laser gate. I think we'll still be fine. I think we managed to pick up some decent weapons. I mostly just need techs, to be honest. Anyway. As the team decides this, I'm gonna go scroll the map to see if there's anything we need to know. Interesting. So we need to just go over there. Anything I should know about as we go through? Get the target to open the door. There are boxes in the room. Okay. Oh, he does okay damage here. Anybody have mates? Uh, yes. I'm gonna drop a lot of them. Yeah, I, I basically haven't been hit at all, so I left them all in a group over there for anybody that needs it. Otherwise, I'll just pick up the spare one. Because as I said before, if you have an item reader on, I highly recommend you turn on the basic items. The remainder of challenge mode. I missed the rest on the other floor, which kind of sucks, but... Oh well. We're gonna do what we can to just kind of hit with Bowie. Ooh, I got paralyzed. Um... Awkward. Alright, let's assist by throwing more fireballs. Thank you for that. Okay, so there's going to be something we can shoot potentially to the north to open a door with boxes. Otherwise, I'm just going to try to stay out of range. I'm the only character impacted by, like, any of these status ailments, so it's a little scary. I'm going to stay back. Oops. I keep hearing that sound and not understanding what that is. I'll check the boxes, team. Just keep fighting. No, 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 no. Okay. I'm gonna let you know, if there's box duty, let me let me get it. Because you guys are the DPS for future reference. Like, you you need to be out there doing damage. Don't, don't item check. I'll take this rod, though. That might actually matter. Um, okay. I got an anti-paralysis and a soul atomizer, so I should be good if I get tagged. I see a Zalora's drop somewhere. Oh, someone getting hit without scape. Oh... Uh... 
So now I have something to debuff the boss, which is huge. Let's go ahead and assign some new abilities. Oh, I started with Shifta. I am so sorry. I didn't realize I started with more spells. I am so sorry, team. I could have been buffing you. I didn't even think to check to see if I got it yet. Alright, my bad. Ooh. Yeah, they reset the palette, and I was like, oh, maybe I'm fine. He's going to the right here, which looks correct. Alright, so sorry about that, team. I could have been shifting this whole time. I was thinking I was going to get it by mines. I didn't think I would have it in caves, because I did not... I don't think I had it in the other area. Where if I did, I just didn't see it, and I also apologize for that. Yeah, this is going to help significantly. So all I'm going to do is buff the team. I had to be careful not to use buffs, like, constantly, constantly, but... When we fight those nano dragons, I'll le at least try to allure them. For weapons. The one here. Does team have other weapons they can draw? Drop at least one more. There we go. Also, soundtrack, please. Okay, so that should open the door. Go to the right. I have a rod now for a little more damage. Keep our damage up. Oh, that is such a goofy animation. Look at this go. We're assisting. And it technically worked, but normal, normal, normal. need at least, I think, three mono fluids for the boss, so I want to make sure not to go too crazy with buffs. Like, we don't need it, we don't need it. Oh, so this is another item room if we needed it. We'll keep going. Oh, gosh, there's traps. Scary. There we go, open the path. There's a lot of items over there. But I think for now we're not going that way, we're just going to the exit. Oh, that's a lore range's actual booty. There we go. <laughs> with with Shipta, I can actually do damage. I'll slow them down for the team. It's not, not like the best damage output I've ever done, but it is something. You. Now I can actually hit the dragon. I have a purpose. Yay! <laughs> there we go. Lobbered him. You want know, to be careful to not shift it every single time it's down. I just gotta wait a little bit, so like... Squeezing out every second possible buff is probably good. Ooh, at normal whiff. Protect Dango. Well, I did one damage. Better than nothing. 
rifle, sabers. Probably needed to speed this up, so I'm just gonna do this. Fine. A little low amount of fluids, which is scary. I do think I'm needed for the Nano Dragons. Full level up, perfect timing. There we go. Go to the right. I mean, at least it looks like we're gonna clear it in under an hour 20. An hour 20 is like insanity to me, if that was the, the time that we had to be. Buffed everybody. I'm gonna use a monomate here because it took damage. So the nano dragons for the team. Yeah, so at least I feel pretty useful there. Can't say I can't say about the rest of the clears, but some effort was made. Oh, I need to get away from these lilies. Full on run mode. Shock pain. It's okay, damage. Keep the evil shock off me. I'll kill the dragon. Nicely done. Wow, it came with 40% A beast. It's actually huge. So I'll scroll the map, team can keep running in the meantime. Let's see, up next we have a small area here, so it looks like we just go on a straight line, easy enough. Upper path is items if we need it. Which I might check out since items are just kind of okay. So I'm going to check for items, see if you go into the right. Maybe I could get something nice. Frame with slots, a sword. Ooh, that could be good for our Hugh friend. Armor, daggers. Ooh, lots of good choices. Two slaughter coming up. I'm going to try to put it near Dango. I'm going to hunt him down. Or Hugh Casil friend. I think our Hugh Casil would like some panic daggers. Ooh. This thing, the rest of it kind of blows, but whatever. Extremely high. Oh no, I'm being lasered. Getting kind of low on healing, which is scary. Let's level up. Her damage is at least starting to catch up a little bit. Hopefully we can find more mono fluids. Otherwise I think I might be I might be tapped out for a while, chat. Do what I can here. Regen some TP. I'll definitely take that to the anonymizer actually. And some TP. I think it was like a little too aggressive with spells on the prior floor, so I gotta be careful. Worst slot frame dropped. Interesting. I do have a Knight's Power for whoever just picked that up. Hold on to the rifle for now. Assuming Chris did. Put in here, Chris.
Probably level two. It's, it's a lower level than what I have. Oh, I started with level three. So sad. There we go. I don't know what this fire room is, but it looks scary. Okay, so I'm assuming I stand on this. Team will just need to get to the other end, I think. Assuming team is good now. Okay. Good enough. Apparently there's like six quadrillion traps in this room. Good to know. So there's I think a hidden treasure room. I'm gonna get the hidden treasure room. Shield, Fine Cane, Shield. Okay, lots of throwaways. In the meantime, since the team is waiting, let's scroll. They start down there. It looks like they're going to go in a big loop counterclockwise. If anybody still needs gear, let me know. Not an upgrade for me. It is. Oh, no. I didn't realize Chris moved. That sucks. I'm down to my last heal. I'm gonna drop a core shield in the middle of the room. Definitely want that general mind. My Barda here is not bad. I need so much to level still. Has anybody been seeing any monofluid? I'm basically at zero now. Might be on their own for a while. Take the rifle in case we need it for later. Yeah, it's unfortunate that some of these maps are different sizes. It cuts off a little bit. Apologies for that. Now we're here. There's an order of the switches we need to step on. It'll be one, then two. Then three is in the... Three's right next to me. You can come back. I think we messed up. <laughs> Let me get the switch work here. Oh, I see what happened. So, one, two... Oh, no, 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 no. Actually, we're doing it fine. So, as long as somebody's over there, I'm going to stay on this one. Then, once they are across, according to the map order, then, yeah, now five can be pressed. And I guess I'll step on one of these. Looks like the team is making progress. That's a good sign. So now team has opened up the way. Thank you, team. Got through. So I don't think there's a boss. I think this is it. So oh, I'll I'll try to manage my TP a little more. But I am dangerously low. I definitely want to barda the nano dragon, because that takes the team forever to kill. But this guy aiming at me kinda sucks, I'm not gonna lie. Trade. That was not a good trade. Okay, I'm out of healing. Ooh, monofluid. Thank you so much. 
open some boxes while I'm here. Dime eight, okay. I'll leave that for well. Actually, I'm out of I'm out of healing. I kind of needed. Unfortunately, I missed that rester earlier. Oh, game. That was a bad time for my controller to disconnect. That really sucks. Do I still not have a Zon? Damn, I don't. Brutal. Get rid of you. I take another hit, so I don't want to monomate yet. Do we want to go... South first? And everybody else can go to the door. What is this? Shield? Uh, I might have enough. One, two, actually, three. I need one more from the team. I think we're good. Maybe? Oh, did somebody drop an armor? Armor doesn't count. That's why I got confused. Need a shield. There we go. Uh, so I'm gonna I'm gonna play it low key. I was gonna say I don't want to do anything too crazy. We're almost at the end. I have enough on a fluid to maybe get me there. My goal is to kill the nano dragons, since that takes a lot of time for the. No! He hit me! I have skipped all, though. I've skipped all. It's so annoying, though. <laughs> I forgot how slow it is when you cast. Man. I was gonna level up and get my MST back there. It's so brutal. Because I think it is actually worth dying on purpose for TP. I was gonna wait until uh, I ran out again. Oh well. Let's see. I will... Power material on the floor. Good for the team. Other guy scares me. I have to unequip for fast casting here. There we go. So we're almost at the end, according to this. There's no boss, to my knowledge. So we'll go to the right here. And what is this room that it's warning me about? Place is dark and it's traps. Once you step on the switch, either blue or red flames will appear one at a time, destroy them to move into the next room. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna stand on the switch. Team can kill the flames. Get the flames. Yeah, there we go. I'll just regen TP while I'm here. There we go. Yeah, this one seems like a pain in the butt to redo. So I'm gonna make sure when we do it next time I check for a shift as a lore. We're good. So we should just be at the exit. There's just one more room, I think, to go through after this. That might have enemies, maybe. I'll burn what I can here. Bonk. <laughs> there we go. So sadly, I feel like I had a use in level one, level two, not so much. But I had a feeling that was going to be like that for a while. That's fine. At least we now know to double check our stats. I had a range, really. Got him. Okay, so we just need to go up another room. 
Soul Animizer, War Shield. It's fine, I have one anti paralysis left. So, whatever TP I have is gonna have to make it to the end of the game. I think we're almost done. Might be final room. It says the next level. Oh no, is there. Do we still have to keep going with this? If so, I might be in trouble for later. This thing lied to me, chat. Hopefully, it just means, like, just it's over, not we have to go to the boss. If we have to go to the boss, I'm gonna be very sad. Just to let you know. There's basically no way I'm making it through the boss fight as is. Okay. I'm use my face as a decoy. Did we really get Narlily? Seriously? I don't want to go within like a million miles of that. We're actually getting trolled. I was gonna say, this better be end of challenge. I was gonna say, good. That was a long challenge. Ooh, we're getting out of there. Yeah, stupid Millily. So let's see what's next on the agenda. Not the right area, give me. We'll do one more stage and then we'll, we'll take a break from challenge mode. I'm sorry, what what the heck is all what is this one? Okay, well we'll we'll try. I'm just looking ahead. It's just kind of outrageous. You know what I'll do? Since the maps are so wide, why don't I let it spill over the chat a little? I think that would help us. Yeah, I'm I'm okay with it extending into my field of view. I think chat needs to see the map. <laughs> yeah, we, we we'll we'll play to the end of this one. So it looks like we go left, we go up. There's traps there. What's up there? Should get that. There's some kind of teleporter. The problem with like there's like walkthrough hints, but like it's not saying like you know, 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.3. I guess it kind of is, but not really. Okay, so I guess I will go on a grand journey to ignore all enemies. That's what I'm looking at. Notify the others when you arrive in the locked door. Okay, so that, that one has a lot of instructions, so we'll, we'll figure it out as we go. This will be the last one. So hey, we got through a third of them. Which is more than I thought we would get through. And we'll go back to normal PSO stuff. So yeah, definitely my bad. I'll, I'll leave the map ex expanded a little bit. So we'll cut off the detail, but I think it helps the chat to see a little more. Speaking of a little more, can I just scoot it down just They wait check and see what they need to do. I'm not Viridian. Oh, it's over. Okay, so at least we're basically just going forward for a little bit. I gotta spend time reassigning all my slots, which is ultra annoying, I would just like to state. Yeah. Still don't start with Resta, which sucks. No point to debanding. He just has to quote unquote do better. Oh, that 
animation is so terrible. I'm trying to bully the Grass Assassin here. Because I do like a bazillion damage to him. Well, I'm multi-hitting the, uh, the dragon, so that's huge. Oh gosh, I really don't want to split those by accident. I'm going to leave it to the fire trap users, to be real with you. What? 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 Why oh, didn't Foey hit? Why oh, didn't go through? I want somebody to clip that. The Foey just went right through. That was rude. Where was my Foey? That was BS. I was aimed at him and he just went, nope. There we go. Nice fire trap. Oh, man. Oh. So slowly just walked out of range of it. I deserve that hit in face. I'm going to try to open these boxes as we continue forward. Mono Fluid is huge. I'll pick up a grinder for the team. Paralysis is huge for me. I'm just going to do the world's slowest countdown. Item. Bowie is terrible. I got to kill him. There we go. Looks like, wait a minute. Keeps damage, not as good as it was earlier. <clears throat> yeah, definitely the Hugh cast and the Hugh Castile starting with Big Sword is a big time save. I hit both. I don't really wanna I don't really wanna hit him anymore. I can avoid it. Regen some TP. Go up and to the left. To pick up a rifle, I think that'll be useful for Chris. I'm also going to give him a defense material and a grinder. Chris is currently just using regular gun. That rifle should be a big damage boost for him. Especially since it's 50% ABs, which is silly. Go to the left. I'll need assistance with traps, not in this room, but on the next room. Um, I'm gonna burn a mo mono fluid so I can deal with the nano dragon. There we go. Regen some TP. I'm gonna recognize I'm not needed. That was an easy room. Or shield. I'll leave it there for the team. Gen some TP. I'm gonna have to go on a magical journey. And then something about me telling the team I need to hit a piston, whatever the heck that means. The team can open the boxes. Oh boy, I think I understand now. Oh boy, somebody help me. Ooh, damage. So at some point, someone will have to step on that piston switch. So just be aware, that, that switch at the northern side, I will need at some point. I'm, I'm going for it. I'm going to try to ignore the enemies. Okay. I'll need this switch hit. Guys, where are you going? Where are you going? No, bad. All of you need to go. So there we go. Now I can step on this one. Yeah, once you step on that, I should be good. There we go. We're good now. Go to the south. Oh, somebody needs to let me in. Uh, no, I'm getting locked by the team. No, <laughs> I'm getting trolled. You guys got to give me like at least a second to go through. I almost got it soft locked. That would have been super bad. Right, now I'm out at least. So team will continue to the south.
So from there, we're basically going downwards in a straight line. It looks like there's a small room I can open for items, so I'll do that since I'm kind of useless as a force here, sadly. Just burn too much TP. I'll, I'll do what I can to do normal attacks to maybe stun lock, but don't expect too much help for a while. I'm going to drop two anti-paralysis because I don't need this many two antidotes for the team. Or I just get paralyzed full screen. Okay, that sucks. Well, I will go pick up the anti-paralysis then. Okay. I only want the mine material. I'll take a diamond. Drop a monomate as I run. This room, I'm going to go take a detour. Teams should continue going to the south. You know what? They're grouped up. I might as well. It's just part of them. I said, ow. I don't know what team did, but ouch. So it's the, yeah, it's the far, oh, that's what it is. It, it was the far right one future reference. I realized the switches were there. Okay, so let's get a buff going for the team. They're damaged slightly. There we go, we help with the combo kill. Okay, so we're coming up to another horrible monstrosity murder fest. Um... I'll stand on the switch, so careful, careful, careful. No, 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 no. Pay attention to the map. Do you need to you need to go on a diagonal from bottom right? So it would be from Okay, I can't I can't do it. Somebody stand on the switch, I will do it. Somebody stand on the switch, I'll do it. Thank you. Alright, so it's this one. And then so somebody stand on this one. Somebody come to me. This one. Again, I need to Team, I need you. Okay. Somebody need. I need all three players here, I think. So come here. Somebody hit the one I was just on. Then I can hit this one. I need one more. There we go. I think we're good now. Oh, Chris. Chris, you need to come. Chris, you need to come help in the middle. Dango will stand there. Where we, where we could rotate through. Guys, we just pick, pick a choice. Either everybody stands in the middle, or somebody stands on the side. Yeah, we'll help eventually. Okay, we're all here at least. We got there eventually. Alright, so now that we're here... Uh... Go through here. A part of whiffing is the worst feeling ever. I don't need that antidote, but I will pick it up so the team can consume it. Oh, that really sucks. I just got ambushed while picking up items. Let me unequip this rod. It's causing me to get into a lot of problems. There we go. This, open the boxes, or the material, grab it for me, because my HP is terrible. Defense material. Nothing of interest dropped there, sadly. Just those items. Alright, so once we go through here, we'll go to the next level. What I'll do is while I regen some TP, I'm gonna scroll the map. That way we get a little heads up of what's happening. Head to the teleporter and split up in pairs. The person I went through teleporter one will have to step on either of the correct switches in order to deactivate the barrier. So. Alright, so we're gonna come into a room with two teleports. But until then, we can stay grouped. Ooh, thank you for the mono fluid. We got a buff for the team. And if I just had anything other than a rod, I would be so happy. The rod is so terrible. I'll open the boxes, just keep moving. Just keep moving. There's an auto gun here. I will probably give this to the Hugh Casile. I will equip this rod. I'm gonna try to walk over to Imperimeter to drop this gun. Chris has a pistol. 
Or Hugh Castile would be able to potentially use that immediately. Would also be a big damage increase. And equip the new rod. Maybe it's a little bit better. Yeah, this is where like I'll try to I'll try to item manage. Plus I'm on voice, so I can probably more easily just say like an item's coming your way. Wait, I can't equip the stick? Why? I need 32 more MST. Are you serious? Is that even possible in this run to use it? Oh, I shouldn't have taken that. Oh, good. I have some mono... ...mates to give out, although I did just get lasered. Ooh, don't kill me, please. We need to use Barda here, since I'm definitely the fastest at killing those. There we go. So eventually we're gonna need to split up the hog. If I had a slotted armor, that would have been huge. So unfortunate. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, uh, I don't know about that. So we'll make a hard right and then we'll just split into teams of two. So it sounds like the people that are in teleporter one are gonna be waiting longer and the teleporter two will be stronger. That's what I'm gathering. Only destroy the right boulders in the top room. Okay. This. Go through here. I'm going to go take the teleport on this side. I need one person to go with me. Now we're here. It's gotta see. Oh boy, what the heck is this? Okay, so there's two correct switches. One is here, where I'm standing, so I need Dango to stand here. And the other is... already pressed, it looks like. Okay, I think we're good then. So with that, we I'm gonna go to the item room to the left that's hidden here. There's a lot in here, apparently. Interesting. And then from there, we just need to make our way to the northern room. So if everybody's good, we'll continue there. I'll just try to pick these up. It's kind of hoping for something a little more substantial than healing items, but maybe the team needs it, so maybe worth. Now everybody's good. Oh. Careful. Go through the northern door here. Sorry, there's a hidden wall. I should have specified. Uh, just be careful. We only want to hit the right boulders. Don't hit the ones on the left. I can drop a dimate for the team because I actually don't need that. I'm gonna drop another monomate so everybody gets healed up. Only hit the ones on the right if you're able to. So between these two choices, we're gonna hit the one on the right. And our goal is immediately go to the right. I'm gonna hit the switch so team can run. Team can run. I'm gonna scroll the map so we can see what the next area is. That wasn't too bad. And the next one we're gonna go north until we get to the puzzle room. That's gonna be fun. <laughs> so we're at the bottom. We're slightly cut off on the mini map here, but we're gonna go up basically three rooms, make a left. And we're gonna consult the puzzle diagram. Okay. Stood too close, I deserve that. Like an okay amount of fluids. Mostly just want to make sure I kill the nano dragon since that gives the team a lot of problems. There we go. I'm pretty close to leveling, so I should probably shift it while I can. I did actually use up quite a few of my resources. Good. Is there anything I could give the team? I gave out most of my monomates. I could drop like one more monomate pretty safely. I'm gonna leave it like near the entrance for if I need it. Nice leveled up. Oh, maybe maybe the other cane weapon is if the photo roll was here. She would have enough meter. Alright, so we have choice. Let's go to the left. 
Oh, oops, am I too early? One, two. Be able to go that way. Hmm. Oh, is it taller than I thought? One, two, three. Oh. It just wasn't labeled properly. Who would have thought? I was like, wait a minute. No, this is the team went the right way. There is a door there, but it didn't do anything. Probably should have labeled that. But anyway, I'm going to open the boxes. We're coming up to the puzzle room. Let's be warned. Our material there. Leave it to the team. The just head to the north. I'll open these up. Marksman arm. I'm going to bring that for the team. Okay, so it's the bottom. So think of if it's a if it's two rows of three, we need the bottom left and we need the middle. So, so somebody I think needs to somehow get the switch. The team, I need somebody over here to hit this switch. And then somebody else stand on the mini switch. All right, so I'm gonna hit the correct switches. Just let Chris out when I'm done. So it should be According to the layout, it should be this oh, team. You can't leave the switch. This switch and this switch. Okay, we're good. Let's let Chris out. And let's go to the north. That wasn't too bad. Although I'm still ultra scared of Lily just locking me out of the game. Get out of here, Lily. Okay, so it looks like mostly smooth sailing until we get to the far north, so not really any big choices to make. I'm gonna see if there's anything I can do. I have a random marksman arm I'm gonna drop. A uh, random try grinder for whoever wants it. Yeah, we got some downtime here, I think. I do 67. I should be able to kill the slime very quickly. As long as it just pops up, I can hit it. Here we go. I'll let team kill it. F5 health. I believe in you. Okay, so we're gonna go through here. There's like a small detour, but I don't see any items listed, so I'm gonna ignore it. Lily's really pleased with itself at Poison the Cast. I think it's going to be profoundly disappointed soon. Should be a little more aggressive, because I have an okay amount of mono fluids. Okay, so team will make... Turn to the right. Can't even go that way. Looks like some kind of detour to the left once we get into the next route. And then we all go to the north. Maybe it's a hit a switch scenario. There's a lot of boxes here. I'm gonna focus on opening those. Good luck, team. Oh, I finally got Gafoe. Huh. I'm gonna leave some mono mates there. The armor for the team would be huge. I never found a basic frame, sadly. So I'm gonna go to the left. Team could go to the upper right. I think I just like, gotta hit a switch or something. Yeah, I just gotta hit a switch. Perfect. Then there's some kind of horrible monstrosity coming up. What does the note say? You know the room sliding away on the rocks that on some of the body of water. Oh, okay. Oh, we gotta shoot the. Okay, you gotta shoot the switches. Okay. Sure. And then there's some crazy zigzag path after that. Okay. Okay, so there's switches down. Yeah, there we go. I think we hit almost all of them. There should be a couple over here somewhere. Might need a gun. Are they against the wall or something? Just don't see where they are. Found one. Maybe they're in the bushes. Yeah, okay, there we go. 
So, some kind of craziness is gonna happen. I'm gonna take this warp. I'm gonna be here. Then... Someone will need to stand here. And there's like a zigzag path you have to follow. Ooh, chat. Chat, consult the zigzag guide. If you if you don't want to do the zigzag, let me do the zigzag. Yeah, don't don't just step blindly. Zigzag attained. So maybe the team has to go through that. But then I think I have to stand on this switch so everybody could come in. Not sure how that works. Yeah, okay, so Dango will teleport over there and he can stand on the other switch. And then that should be good. Okay. The team could go back, I think. If you're a blue player, you could just turn around and leave. Just come back the way you came. You should be good now. Yeah. Everybody else will go to the next area. Yeah, I thought we were going to have to fight something, so I was like, I'm, I'm willing to go through, but we did not. So this one's a really short area. We just go up, right, up. That's easy. What a mercifully small stage. Let me uh, buff people. Uh oh. I'm so scared. Oh, where's the team? Where did they go? I'm, I'm so confused, hold on. Oh, I can't go back. Uh oh, team, where'd you go? You had to go through the doors that we unlocked. Unless we're split or something weird has happened. Yeah, Chris and I are in the next area. I'll take the TC material. Oh, stuff spawned. Oh, that sucks. Right. I'm still gonna try to do as much as I can to the Nano Dragons. Reapply buffs to the team. Cover some TP. Still have three mono fluids, which is okay. Really just hoping for a frame at this point. I haven't seen any of those drop. Oh well. We're gonna, we're gonna bonk him a little there, I think. Let's level up for the theme. Almost picked up the mana main and I thought better of it. I was <laughs> like, nah, I don't need it. Uh, let me drop a couple more mana mates team as we go through. Will that need it? Trying to be fair about it, since the force doesn't really need it. Oh, there's traps in this room. Cute. I'm sorry, is that a 60 hit brand? <laughs> wait, wait, what? Oh, <laughs> Wow, I wish I, I wish I had that in non-challenge mode, right, chat? Damn. Can you imagine? Just like, oh, you know, we're, we're playing normal mode. We just, you know, we ignored a 60-hit brand. It's not good enough for us. <laughs> Quite something. I'm super low on mono fluid. I'm going to only really attack if I need to at this point. We'll buff up the team to make up for my lack of damage here. Help Chris out of a bind. Basically, the longer I can regen, the better. I'm down to just one mono fluid, which is kind of rough. But I could die on purpose to restore TP. I don't think I'm quite at that point where I want to do that. Why did it foey the wall? Him, please. Nice 
fire trap. I'm gonna say if Team has any fire traps, yeah, there we go. Man, I could not imagine doing that without a cast. That would take forever. Okay, so that one's easy. Let's scroll the map ever so slightly. So we have just... Th that's it. We're at the end. So, we're gonna come up to a puzzle room eventually. Yeah, it's just kind of unfortunate that it's just like, there's not really much I could do, unless a lot of mono fluid drops. So I'm just gonna try to stand still in most areas, or open boxes. I could not imagine playing Fomar here. I think it would just be out of TP always. Yeah, we're gonna regen some TP. Uh, so we can ignore the door to the left. So, looks like we have to stand on a switch here. That'll let us hit the other switches. So it looks like when given the choice, it's always the bottom right of every pillar. So as long as team stands on the bottom right of every single one, we should be fine. Continue team, I'll, I'll keep it held here. So bottom right, go, go, go. We'll eventually get through, oh my bad. Okay, so that lets me go forward, so that means I can leave now. I'm gonna hold this down. Team has to be real close. There we go. Other oh, bottom right. I'm gonna say somebody has not hit something because we're not making progress. Al, team, please don't hit anything other than the bottom right. Thank you. Okay, now we're free. Oh, this got stuck. How did the team get stuck? I'm so confused. Alright, I'm gonna go rescue the team, I think. I guess the group the team is not moving as a group. There we go. Chris is freed. There we go. I'm gonna free and parameter. There we go. We got there eventually. That's that's the important thing. Uh mine material needed. Damn, I'm so low on TP. before. I'm going to try to regen as much as possible. My character is basically dead weight right now. Try to use at least a bar to here to speed it up a little. Yeah, I can see where the phone roll would be more useful. Having more TP would have been huge here. Oh well. Live with their choices. So we have some choices here, so presumably I'm going to go up. We're eventually going to need to come back through the door we just passed on the right that's red. I don't know if I need help with it. I presumably do. I still need help with it. So once... Whoa! Once we're done with this room... I will probably just kill myself to get TP, to be, honestly, to be honest with you at this point. I am so desperately low, and I've just not received any healing, or... Resources, I mean. I do have escaped all right. I do. I'm gonna hit the switch. Team could go to the south. I'll, I'll get the items. Don't worry about it. One mono fluid. I really need one. And big whiff. Well, team, you're not missing much if it helps you feel better. It's just terrible items. The team will go to the right once they go backwards a door. And uh, we'll continue to the right. There we go. Yeah, I'm, I'm at the point where I think I should just straight up die because my character doesn't do anything anymore. And I still have like a very phenomenal amount of healing. He didn't even kill me, that was disrespectful. I'll do my best to get more TP, but I'm not going to try to live if they hit me. 
Come on. I know you want a laser me, dragon. I know you want to. Come on. Hit me, dragon. No. I was denied my death. <laughs> I, I need to die. Please, something hit me, please. Thank you. Alright, so I just got a ton of TP back. Fortunately, I did pick up an armor, which I don't need. Arrest the spawn. Probably want that. Alright, since rest is there... Yeah, I left some in a pile over there. Um, I'm gonna keep moving, but I don't think I need monomates, so I'm just gonna sprinkle them as I run. Be like a mini game, check and follow. Oh, another enemy. Game, you really the auto aim is so bad at low levels. Holy. Alright, so we got a multi-path here. What is the other point? Split up three to one with three going through the barrier gate. So looking at uh okay. So I'm assuming I'm not sure what that means. Oh, oh, I think I see. What's the split of three going through the barrier gate? Alright, so I, I can't be the one that's left behind, apparently, because I need to solo. The one person come back and swap places with me. Probably Dango, if I had to guess. Or, that's fine. You can still solo. Because you're, you're going to be in solo territory for a while. Okay, so from there... We're going to take the warp. We're going to clear there. And we just need to do something so that you can progress. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Keep going to the right. There's a warp here. There's other switches here. They're kind of in the bushes. Okay. So with that in mind, can we get the other person through? Solo can activate three of them while the other three gets to the last one. Alright, so now I think a parameter can go to the right. There's a lot of switches in this room. I'm standing on one of the real ones. There's one near the waterfall near me. So it looks like there's one on the far north, there's one in the waterfall. It's like right off the edge. It's really evil. Yeah, there we go. Good shot. The other one is at the far north of the room. And I think the other one is also directly in front of me. So if you look up in the sky, I think it's that one. Or it could be the one on the floor. It's kind of hard to tell. Yeah, one of those is real. Oh, whatever one chat hit is not the correct one. There's what there's still one more on the left side you need to hit. It, I think it's Oh you got it, you got it. Okay, that's good. We're good, we're good. Let's see, what's the point for number three? Most of the switches here are traps. Yeah, we know that. Right after you activate the four switches, there's traps waiting for you in the corridor. Wow, that's rude. Good thing I did not go through there, as I probably would have died. Wait, it sent me back here? Wait, what? I probably should have just walked backwards then. That's fine, we'll go south. Anyway, let's proceed. I still have enough fluids, and I think that's it once we get to the end, so I mostly just need to burn all my TP here while I can. And if I need to shift, uh, I can shift. Uh, To help the team out a little with some shifter. Dramatic music as we get to the final room. It looks like a split choice. I might have to hit a switch here. Team can turn around, go to the opposite side. And that'll be pretty much it. 
music playing. We have one room left, and then we're done with this nightmare. Gonna say the victory lap music now. Okay, we're gonna spam as much as we can here. That means I used basically all my mono fluids. So I, I can't be mad about that. Oh boy. Uh, don't leave, please. A multi hit. I'm safe. Let's see how hard this final room is. Up the team. We got Chris. That's fine. There we go. Run, 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 run. Oh, timer stopped. Good. Okay. I was worried it would have to be like when somebody touches it. There we go. Complete. Handed it in. So we did manage to finish three stages. Not bad. It looks like next week we'll complete challenge mode one at this pace. And considering we restarted a couple times, that's not too bad. So let's, I guess, pause the video here. Yeah, stage two felt like it took an eternity. I'm kind of worried what our target time is. What is our target time that we need to be aiming for? I'm not gonna like fret over it on every stage. Let's, let's open the Infinio wiki. We'll leave it in the upper right. Uh, less than seven hours. So if we're averaging half hour per stage, I think that's fine. Yeah. That means we're still way under seven hours currently. How'd the challenge mode go? Welcome back, Promethean. It went okay. We had one stage that was also way under. So as long as we don't go to like 50 minutes, I think we'll be fine. Yeah, like that's fine. So if we have like, let's say the re remaining ones are 35 minutes, right? Let's do quick math. That means we're going to add three hours to the run when we only have an hour total so far. So yeah. So if we, if we start averaging 35 for every other one, we're fine. So, as long as we don't have, like, a 55 minute or we should get the below 7 hours. So we're, we're gonna see the cave boss. The cave boss is the one I'm worried about, taking an eternity. But yeah, that's that's not bad, then. My own ruins already. No way for me, Pian. There are, There are way too many stages. Way too many stages. But anyway, let's go say goodbye to YouTube. If you watch this point in the video of the VOD, I say thank you for watching, and... We'll see what happens next time on uh, Challenge Mode.